90 degrees officially hit at uh, Bush Airport yesterday. Not the case for today as a cool front will be moving through the area. I may be see 13 meteorologist Alita Loresca with a look at your one minute weather. There will be uh, some dense fog you'll have to contend with before that front arrives later on this morning through 9 a.m. A dense fog advisory for our coastal communities, including Chambers County there, much of the county under a dense fog advisory. Look for that uh, cool front to clear out, giving way to some sunshine and a strong northwest wind that will be picking up throughout the day. A wind advisory has been issued just outside Harris County, mainly for our western counties, basically west of I-45 and along the coastal communities west of Galveston. Those north winds will be increasing between 20 to 25 miles per hour, potentially gusting anywhere between 35 to 40. This front will move through mostly dry and yes, the humidity will be falling behind the front. You can see the big drop in the dew point uh, temperatures, indicating that the drier air will eventually overcome that moisture that we're feeling this morning. Look for temperatures to uh, drop down about 10 degrees compared to yesterday. Highs in the upper 70s to low 80s with overnight lows dipping into the mid to upper 40s to low 50s. You'll want that jacket first thing Thursday morning and those winds picking up today, as I mentioned, anywhere between 35 to 40 mile per hour gusts. They should relax overnight tonight into tomorrow morning, but by Thursday afternoon, they will be picking up speed once again, looking for breezy conditions Thursday into Friday as temperatures tumble into the mid 70s and then warming up again as we get into the weekend. Saturday morning will start off in the 40s with highs in the 80s, a little bit more cloud cover. Those winds coming in out of the south will blow in a little bit of moisture as we get into the afternoon and evening hours. Looking ahead past the weekend, we'll start to see storm system emerging over the Pacific Northwest and that's going to send some rain into our area as we look ahead to Monday, Tuesday, and even into Wednesday. Right now we've got Wednesday penciled in for our next cool front, but ahead of that front, there will be a few showers, a few thunderstorms, still too soon to know whether or not we'll be dealing with severe weather, but do know that there could be a few stronger storms arriving as we get into next week. All right, that's a look at your forecast on this Wednesday. Thanks for watching.